It was just before midday today when police were called to Corpus Christi Catholic College behind me to report a teacher had been stabbed. That teacher has been named locally as 61-year-old Anne Maguire who taught Spanish here at the school. She suffered multiple stab wounds with a knife which has now been recovered. Chief Superintendent Paul Money spoke outside the school gates earlier. This is clearly an unprecedented event here in Leeds and a shocking incident the likes of which I've not seen in over 25 years of police service. The reason for that is that schools in Leeds are generally very safe places to work, to visit and to study. And that's helped in part by a partnership approach that the police have with colleagues in the local authority and, and, and an initiative we've actually had in place since 2008 called the Safer Schools Programme. The Safer Schools programme was in place here at Corpus Christi, as it is in many schools of this type across the city. Nevertheless, the incident will understandably have had a massive impact on the family and loved ones of the lady who has tragically lost her life today, as well as staff, pupils at the school and this very close-knit community in East Leeds. Indeed, I've just been into the school to, uh, to talk very briefly with staff members who are here today and it is no exaggeration to say that they are all in shock. West Yorkshire Police will continue to support the community and will do that in a coordinated manner through the local neighbourhood policing team here in the Temple Newsom ward in East Leeds. And you can see behind me now, people are still gathering to leave flowers outside the gates. I've heard Mrs Maguire described this afternoon as the best teacher they'd ever had, who would always go above and beyond for the pupils. I spoke to some of them as they left school earlier this afternoon. She was brilliant. Like, she taught my mum and my sister and me, and like, she taught us all Spanish, and like, she took us skiing and everything. And we just couldn't ask for anyone better. They're just all distraught. They just can't, no one can believe it's happened. It's really, really heartbreaking the way that it's happened. There's no, ever, no, ever like that. This has happened. I've lived here since I was, I, well, I was born here, and I've, this is first time I've ever heard about like this happening here. She can't do enough for people. She never let people fail. If, uh, if there any anything wrong with your work, she'd send it back with corrections, and you had to do them. And she won't let you leave unless you've done them all. So she wanted the best for every pupil, and she thought a lot at school. I mean, she worked there for 40 years. Uh, because uh, she, just, she just celebrated it before Christmas, a 40-year teaching anniversary. So. Well, a 15-year-old boy has been arrested in connection with the incident and is currently being questioned by police. For all the latest updates, you can follow us on Twitter.